Hi folks, President Donald Trump just left the hospital for a drive by greeting to thank his supporters. Dozens gathering outside the Walter Reed Medical Center in Bethesda, Maryland, where he's been where he's being treated for COVID-19. So in the last 30 minutes, the president's motorcade passed the hospital. The president then wore a mask, as you can see, and he waved to the people from inside that motorcade. And by the way, President Trump's medical team said that it has been a weekend of ups and downs as he continues to struggle against COVID-19. Today, his doctors said that he could be released from the hospital as early as tomorrow. His doctors uh, gave an update late this morning. So here's what we know. The president is now being treated with steroid therapy is used for some of the sickest COVID-19 patients. The drug works by reducing inflammation in the lungs, but is not recommended for milder cases because it can help the virus to replicate itself. The president's doctors also say that he experienced dips in his blood oxygen levels. On Friday, President Trump was given supplemental oxygen for about an hour before leaving Walter Reed Medical Center. His oxygen dropped again yesterday, but doctors wouldn't say if he was given oxygen again. Did, did you give him a second round of supplemental oxygen yesterday? Uh, I'd have to I'd have to check with the nursing staff. Uh, um, I don't think that if he did, it was very, very limited, uh, but he's not on oxygen. Um, and and not the only oxygen that, that I ordered or that we provided was uh, that Friday morning initially. So doctors say the president has been fever free since Friday morning. His vital signs are stable. Meanwhile,